On and on boom the drums through mile after mile of unexplored jungle to bring you a story of Africa. The battle between the forces of the Queen and those of the false priests has ended in victory for the professor who is directing the Queen's army. The enemy is routed and taking refuge in the hills. As the professor, Jack, and Nguru watched the closing scenes of the battle, they're informed by a dying man that the Queen and Lorna at the palace are in serious danger. The three set out quickly to defend the women. We ought to be inside of the palace as soon as we get over this hill. Yes, there are the turrets. Pull over there. Hold. Pull up, Jack. Get back out of sight quickly. Keep this side of the ridge. There's a force surrounding the outer palace wall. Do you think they saw us, sir? I hope not. Mo battle, Buana. Huh? It certainly looks like it, Unguru. I should have known those priests would try to get at the queen behind our backs. How are we going to get through those lines? I don't know, Jack. But we've got to get through. We haven't time to wait for our own forces to come up. Buana, ride them plenty quick, Boma gate, huh? No, Unguru. We can't charge through that lot. There's too much open space to cross. They'd square up to meet us. That's out. Look. Look at that rock. It's moving. Careful, Jack. Cover it with your rifle. While I look around, there must be someone behind it. Keep your eyes on it. Maybe we're ambushed. Huh. Mo devil, devil, huh? Why, it's an old man. That rock was a covering of a cave entrance. Hmm. He's seen us. Master. Master. He's beckoning to us. Keep him covered, Jack. It might be a trap. Come on, we'll see what he wants. I think I've seen that old fellow at the palace with the queen. Yes, he's one of the trusted few. I wonder Master, whether... I bring thee greetings from Her Majesty the Queen. Thy approach was seen from the turret, and I was sent to guide thee by the secret way, for the palace is surrounded. Secret way, eh? There's no time to waste. Down you get, Jack. You and Goro. Mm-hmm. The horses will have to be left here, evidently. This is luck. Is the queen and my daughter safe? Her Majesty and thy daughter are safe. But the enemy clamors at the palace gates, and we are but few. Juana, we go for whole like fox, huh? Yes. In you go, Jack. And you, Unguru. Juana, Unguru. No go, argument, no. you black sinner. Get in there. Oh. Oh. The lamp still burns brightly. And to Lord, will I seal the opening. It's pretty dark in here, sir. However, that lamp helps some. I wonder which part of the palace this leads to. In his nose. It's been well made, though. I can stand upright in it. This secret passage was made for men of thy stature, Master. Many hundreds of years ago it was made for such a time as this. There's a door right ahead. Press thy hand to the rock that juts over thy head. This? Ah, mm. see? It opens. The steps lead to the queen's chamber. Well, let's hurry. It'll take them long to get through those outer gates. More doors here. A guard stands beyond. Uh, wait. Last word. Dio lo vult. We are now in the secret wall of the palace, master. In a moment, we will reach the panel that opens into the chamber. Did you hear the password he gave, sir? Yes. The Crusader's motto. Oh, confound this narrow passage. In the walls, did he say? Juana, this way for rat, no fox. Uh, we'll be out of it soon, I think. Master, he's here. Here they are. Oh, I'm so glad you've come. Are you all right, Father? And you, Jack? Of course we're all right, my dear. Oh. question is, are you all right, Lorna? Oh, yes. We yes. had a message that you were Never in... Never mind about that now, Jack. Her Majesty is waiting for news, I know. Yes, great man. We have waited anxiously. Is all well? The forces of the false priests have been scattered. These without the gates must be treated likewise. I have but 50 men to combat 200. Look from this window... The gates must shortly fall. What few men we have 
Must retreat behind the doors of the palace. Hmm. Looks bad. It'll be some time before our forces return. Father, look. There's a white man leading them. Eh? At least I mean a man in European clothes. Lorne is right, sir. Take these glasses. See him? Riding along and giving directions? Yeah. Yes, I see him. Well, that clears up many things. But I still don't know how he got here. Do you know who it is? Yes. That isn't Lamberti. I'm very much mistaken. Take a good look, Lorna. Yes, Father. Yes? That's the man who was giving orders to the witch doctors when they made us prisoners on that hill by the river. Yes. I think he's been the cause of most of our troubles. I guessed as much when you described him before. That man, he is an enemy of thine? Yes, Your Majesty, a personal enemy. Very clever man, but I think he's insane. Hmm. Yet I still don't see how he came down into this country. Probably the same way we did. Of course. Don't you remember I told you I saw someone else sliding down when we started? Mm, maybe that's the answer. Oh, they've blown the gates in, sir. More of Lamberti's tricks. He always could make explosives out of practically nothing. There he goes, riding off. Well, he's opened the way for them. See how they're pouring into the courtyard. Get back, everybody. They may send a few arrows up this way. Oh, there's that awful head, Father. I brought it here because... Yes, listen. If I'm not mistaken, we'll learn something that... <laughs> well, 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 Miss Edwards. What? <laughs> I hope you're listening to me. It's Lamberti's voice. Coming from the talking head. <laughs> Your father is probably dead by now. I wanted the pleasure of seeing him die, but evidently it was not to be. So I shall be there to see you die instead, Miss Edwards. <laughs> Wanna oh. white man voice from head. Yes, and guru. I've known it ever since we camped by the river. The head is one of Lamberti's inventions. But that doesn't help us now. Lamberti doesn't know we're here, Jack. That means that he doesn't know the result of the battle. But how about the talking head, sir? Lamberti fooled me, Jack. If you remember... Lamberti and I were working on that language together when the break came. Yes? The talking head is nothing but an ultra-modern radio of some sort. He's been trying to lead me into a trap in a part of the country where he could dispose of me and he wouldn't be suspected. He almost got us up on that hill. But the head's been talking since then. Yes. The man evidently didn't think I suspected the trick. Although I ceased following directions. What a radio, sir. How does he get the power he to... He takes electricity out of the air. The man's a genius. I haven't had a chance to take the thing to pieces and look it over. Ah, I will if we get out of this situation alive, though. They're battering the doors down. If we can only hold them off until our own forces get back. Ah, what's Lamberti up to now with his explosives? He's not with a crowd out there. That explosion seemed to come from underground. The secret passage. Perhaps That's they it. have... Someone must have told Lamberti of the passage. That's where he went. He's removing those doors with that infernal explosive of his. He's a madman, Jack. Then he might blow up the palace. He might if he thought I was in it. But he's after Lorna now. We'll have to let him come up and try to deal with him then. But good Lord, sir. We daren't let him. Hello. Hello. What's that shouting for? Over the hill there. Look. Those are our men returning. If the palace door holds out for another 15 minutes, we'll be... What? Professor Edwards is alive yet. Eh? Lamberti. Eh? Yes. Lamberti. <laughs> the faker, as you once called him. <laughs> you should have guarded your secret passage a little better. Uh, I've waited a long time for this, Edwards. Yes, I suppose you have. Now, but... don't come too close. See this wooden flask I have in my hand? <laughs> yes, my friend. One of our little hobbies. It contains a powder that explodes upon contact with atmosphere. <laughs> the stopper is tied around my neck, and if by any chance my hand falls away, the stopper is naturally pulled out. <laughs> so you see, shooting me would do you no good. <laughs> In that case... You will go with us, too. Uh, of course, under the circumstances. I had planned otherwise, but... 
Nice woman. Lorna. Lorna, are you safe? Yes. But where's father? Here. Is the queen safe? I am not harmed. Thy warrior is. Guru. My boy. What in the name of... Oh, well. I guess it was the only way. But what happened? And Guru threw his spear at Lamberti. No, Jack. When Guru threw his spear at the flask of explosive and carried it through the opening in the wall into the secret passage. That's why we're all alive now. The main force of the explosion was taken in the tunnel. Snake woman, sleep, Buana. Yes, and Guru, this snake woman has kissed her fill and sleeps well. What does he mean, Jack? His spear is no more. It was blown to atoms. Poor and Guru. Oh, Father, your arm. Oh, it's nothing, my dear. Just some skin off, I guess. Great man. How can a queen thank thee for thy work? Thou art of another world, I know. Tell me, Your Majesty, is there a way through the rock that binds your kingdom round? If departure is thy wish, then must my sorrow give it room. Yes, there is a way, but no man hath returned to speak of its dangers. Through that passage come what the priests have called the sacred apes. I knew it. Those apes belong to the outside world. Well, children, it looks as if we'll be on our way soon, right? Okay, sir. Where's Lamberti? Oh, uh, under that pile of stones. Where's the talking head, Jack? I wanted it's to... It's crushed, sir. Crushed under that fallen wall. Uh, gone, eh? Priceless secrets. The inventions of a madman. All lost to the world. <laughs> <laughs> 